Kwenye kwa kampuni ya Kenya Power imelaumiwa kwa kumtelekeza kijana mmoja wa miaka 28 ambaye aliteketezwa na moto baada ya nyaya za stima kuninginia kiholela katika kijiji kimoja eneo la Bondo huko Siaya. Felix Onyango alilazimika kukatwa mkono na mguu na sasa anaishi na ulemavu huku familia yake ikitaka kampuni ya Kenya Power kuwajibika. Kaunti ndogo ya Bondo katika kaunti ya Siaya. Boma la familia ya Ogejo. Na hapa tunakutana na washiriki wa familia waliojawa na huzuni. Felix anaishi na ulemavu uliosababishwa na kuteketezwa na nyaya za umeme zilizokuwa zikininginia barabarani alikokuwa kipita. Felix alipata majeraha mabaya katika tukio hilo la Januari mwaka 2021. This is not my life. Yeah. But I'm, I'm really trying to, to you know uh, get myself to where I was as much as it will not be easy to get my limbs back but to move on with my life. Felix mwenye umri wa miaka 28 amepoteza sehemu ya mkono wake wa kulia, sehemu ya mguu wake wa kushoto na ana vidonda ambavyo haviponi. Ripoti ya matibabu inaonyesha kuwa mkono wake wa kulia uliathirika vibaya. Wakazi wanailaumu Kenya Power kwa tukio hilo. Wakaripoti kwa Power hawakuwa wamechukua chochote any action. So I also went to court and report. Watu wa polisi baadaye wakaenda hapo. Ndio wakaenda wakaambia watu wa Power kati kumbe hiyo kitu is dangerous. Ndio wakaanza ku replace na concrete. Inadaiwa kuwa siku hiyo ambayo Felix alipata majeraha, nyaya ya stima ilikuwa ikininginia karibu na mti wa Mwembe. Rasha rasha ya mvua iliyokuwa ikinyesha ilifanya eneo hilo kuwa hatari. Felix alikuwa akitumia barabara hiyo kwa miguu aliteketezwa na umeme muda mfupi kwenye matembezi yake. At my age I think I should be doing things on my own you know supporting my family supporting myself and even uh, maybe doing some investments if need maybe I'm going to school to teach having pursued uh, 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 education I should be working right now. Licha ya kuandika barua ya malalamisho kwa kampuni ya Kenya Power, familia hii imesalia katika majonzi. Kenya Power imetumia muda wa miezi 19 kuandika barua ikidai kuwa inachunguza tukio hilo la Januari. Taarifa ya kampuni hiyo sasa ikisema kuwa uchunguzi umefanywa na taarifa kamili itatolewa karibuni. I think what wa power should compensate the boy. Because he is almost 30 years old na mimi pia unaona sasa nimekuwa mzee na huyu sasa pia sasa sana unajua ni mzigo wangu na yeye bado akona miaka mingi ya kuishi na mimi unajua miaka yangu imeenda so i cannot continue supporting him for so long yeah he needs his own life Felix amekumbana na masaibu tangu tukio hilo mkewe alimkimbia na anatumainia usaidizi wa watu ili kupata matibabu it really pushes me Uh, it's a me and an arm to go about it it's not easy but i'm trying by grace of god uh, i want to believe all shall be well uh, at the end of the tunnel there must be a light huku akiendelea kukabiliwa na masaibu familia ya felix ina matumaini kuwa atapata haki